So, day two of the Cheltenham Festival starts with the bumper. As the weather is champion bumper, it's a grade one event over two miles. So, first up is Cleveland Soldier for Vinnie Gerard along with Fresno Park. Last roll for David Hooney, Rebellion for Paul Road, Small Chances for Alex Cherry, Blinded for Pontypool Racing, Magellan for Kevin Munahan, Regents Forward for James Shea, Sean Sessa for Paul Road, Wood Spirit for Leon Van Rensburg makes up the tent. Fight for this grade one bumper here at Cheltenham. Day two, race one. The nine races we've got today from Cheltenham. The starter's got him away. So you wait for him to sort themselves out. And it's a two mile course. It is David Hooley's last royal that's reluctantly leading us. And it's last royal. About five wide from the from the fence and drifting further over, looking for some better ground. We're going to come past the grandstand and we'll go out for another circuit. His last roll from a wall of horses. Take your pick. The widest of all is the grey blinded for Graham Clutterbuck. The nearest one to us is Alex Cherry with small chances. Follow up with his successful day yesterday of three wins. He needs the leaderboard going into day two. But it's David Hooney's last roll that leads us. And nosing through is Paul Rhodes' Sean Sessa there. And Weinstein is the grey blinded. Just on his inside is the green silks and red cap of Regents forward. And they've been a little bit caught there as they just start to swing left handed. But its last roll still leads now from small chances moving to second. And Fresno Park and Cleveland Soldier for Vinnie Gerard. And the ominous Wood Spirit for Leon Van Rensburg just on the inside of Sean Sessa. Wider still is the grey blinded. And they're just followed through by. Uh, Rebellion for Kevin Meenahan, Magellan, which is Paul Rhodes' other horse, number four, you can see that. And then Regents Ford, who's dropped right back now towards the rear. So, still up front, this last royal as they go through the first mile. Last royal from uh, Alex Cherry, small chances in Wood Spirit, then the two Vinnie Gerard horses between Fresno Park and Cleveland Soldier. Great Clutterbuck's grey, blind on the wide outside. And they just followed through by Sean Sessa and Magellan. Regents Ford and Rebellion. So they're well inside the final mile now as they go uphill. It's the last roll that leads us by about four to Wood Spirit is moving to second on his own, goes over towards the round now. And small chances of Alex Jerry in third. We've got the grey on the wide outside moving up into fourth now. Tacked over towards the fence in between those is Fresno Park with Vinnie Gerard and the others are under a little bit of pressure at the rear now trying to make up some ground. And that's Miguel and Sean Sessa, Regents Forward, Cleveland Soldier and Rebellion. But it's the last roll that still leads as they start to race downhill now from small chances in second. Wood Spirit is third, Blinded is fourth, Fresno Park is fifth. And the others have all got a bit caught for the pace here. But it's the last roll that still leads us as we come down to the final half mile and he's starting to pull away in here. He's got a 2 3 length advantage from small chances. Chances. Wood Spirit on the inside, on the outside is blinded. Fresno Park's got himself blocked in here, Vinny won't be happy, but it's last roll that leads by about three now to Wood Spirit in second. Small chances blinded and Fresno Park. I don't think anything else is going to get into this. We come down to two furlongs from home, and it's last roll that still leads us for David Hooley looking for his first first outright win after his dead heat yesterday. Leads by a couple from Wood Spirit in second, chasing on small chances, Brian Brat blinded and Fresno Park, but last roll still leads as we come down to the final felon but here comes Wood Spirit, last roll's got nothing left and Wood Spirit just cruises on by, being chased down by Fresno Park as well, so Wood Spirit for Leon Van Rensburg going to take the first down the bumper from the fast running on Fresno Park, but he's not going to catch him, David Hughes last roll was in third Max Cherry I think just got a fourth with small chances, a long time leader there, last roll just flagged at the end now Leon Van Rensburg horse just to cruise on by as well as Vinnie Gerrard's Fresno Park have got up for second well down third was last roll for David Hooley fourth was small chances for Alex Cherry and we'll move on to race 15 which is Golden Miller's JLT